What's up guys? I'm back! A huge thanks to my newest subscriber, Brian from Kenya. Sup bro? Welcome to the party! So today I am going to be showing you my newest little whitetail. He's had about two weeks to settle in now and I fed him twice. Um, he's literally the smallest whitetail I've ever seen in my life and um, he's very fast. So yeah, I've got him in this tiny little catch cup here. And he's got the tiniest little water dish which needs topping up. Now because his, he's so small, his water dish is absolutely tiny. It's just like a little Nurofen pill hold it the tiny little pill bit itself so i actually see if i can quickly pull it out and show you here we go so that is the water dish this tiny little pill container so i'll shut this lid because he is super quick and super little and we'll also be doing a check-in on my other white tail um frank has not been eating now i'm not sure if he's due to molt or what's happening there but also i need to fill out the water dish so yeah it's going to be a pretty quick video but i thought you guys might like to see my white tails and how they are doing um i did set my slater spider loose because she was just a complete savage and too hard to handle so yeah just my two white tails now so yeah i will flip the camera and show you guys my new white tails awesome so i've gone and filled them up and so my white tail doesn't drown like what happened to one of my last ones i've only a little bit filled it and i've got the wee water canister there so now i'm going to open up and kind of give you guys a bit of a bird's eye view of what i'm doing we're going to use the whiskers first because i need my hands for this got to use my fingers so you guys can see everything so yeah, I will, hmm, oh, there's a bit of, wet. oh, there he is right there on the end, can you guys see him, focus before this little shit bolts on me. down oh okay this is not working come on focus there we go to the tiniest little white tail see how he's so young he's got little white legs it's not even fully developed yet beautiful little spider i can't really get a close-up of him because he is being very um moving. he's moving around a lot there we go oh see how tiny he is he's the tiniest little white tail ever and like i said he is really fast oh 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 but that's okay so i'm glad you guys got to see that so like i said he did get a feed the other day i won't feed him but he is really fast so i'll just pop that back on piece of cake and he didn't run away gotta love that that was a very badly recorded video but that's okay because now we've got frank okay frank have you molted let's see what you're up to where are you for starters oh shit right there so there we have frank and it does look like he is going to molt soon so um i'm just going to try swap the light we need some light here there we go much better so as you can see frank is doing really well really healthy looking spider So I'm just going to leave that still because he is a gorgeous little guy. Absolutely stunning. So that's his whole enclosure. And I usually put the water dish right down next to this corner here. And this rock is actually used for him to step up onto so he doesn't drown. Because um, I've had a couple of them drown themselves, which is terrible. 
So he needs like a bit of something to walk up onto. So yeah, and that is Frank. So like he is just in a really good position right there, isn't he? So he's very docile, so I'm pretty comfortable actually picking this up. Wouldn't do it with a lot of white tails, but yep, Frank is just one of those white tails. Very lucky there. And just on a final update, sadly I could not get any acetone to preserve my um, mouse spider here. So she's started to decay, which is really, really sad. She's got some beautiful fangs there. Beautiful fangs there. I said beautiful fangs. Beautiful fangs. Dang it. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, sadly, I couldn't find some acetone, so I was unable to preserve this girl, which is a real shame, because look at the size of her. She's just stunning. Well, she was anyway. So yeah, that's a real shame I wasn't able to do that. But I'm glad I got to share that with you guys. So yeah, that was, like I said, a pretty short little update on my spiders. I don't want to stress my young one out. I'm not sure what I'm going to call it yet because I'm unable to sex it so small. I was thinking maybe if it's a girl we might name her Lucy since it's the smallest one I've ever found I'll be able to rear this one up um, and it should hopefully become as you know friendly as Frank has where I can actually just put my hand in there and do what I need to do and um, yeah obviously this little one hasn't gotten used to me lighting it up so I can see it and show you guys and everything but if you liked this video hit the like and subscribe button and if you want to be notified of my new uploads. Oh my goodness, I'm getting really bad at my tongue ties today. Hit the notification bell for my new uploads. I'll just leave it at that. It's nice and simple, right? And see you like that. So, yep. Yeah, gotta like spiders. Hopefully I will get a really big one one day. That would be pretty awesome. Still on the hunt for now. Have a good one, peeps.